both have its role. First of all, it depends on how cute the situation is, and it depends on what you're more familiar and what you have available. But definitely, echocardiography has a role. But let's first turn to some beautiful images that we can generate with the help of CT and even MRI. What you can see here is you can see the entire aorta very nicely. You can reconstruct the images, and uh, sometimes for confirmation, we need to do both imaging modalities. But when we come to echocardiography, I think one of the major advantages is that we can suspect dissection already from a transthoracic echocardiogram, and we can see things, for example, such as here on the left side, where we have a dissection membrane, and we can see the entry site and even the extra site of a dissection. So these are advantages that we have with echocardiography, and we're quick. We can perform the echocardiography on the bedside and even on the intensive care unit without bringing the patient to the CT, just plug a TE probe in and look at the aorta. And even when using ultrasound, we can actually use a transthoracic approach or a transesophageal approach, intravascular ultrasound, and also abdominal ultrasound.